Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Hungry Dragon where I have accumulated 1,931 gold shards which you know what that means we're going to max out hopefully fingers crossed I haven't, I haven't done the maths uh, one of these dragons before we do that actually let's uh, let's quickly go hatch and get um, well by the looks of it another 10 shots no no I, I didn't buy I, I didn't I didn't go here go in the flash sale and, and buy the 1,500 shards no no I would never do something like that anyway let's carry on so, I've already got like two extra levels on this guy, the Mecha Muncha. But I was wanting to kind of max up this guy because I don't really use it too often. And uh, the other dragon's the one I go for. Plus, that one got the most views. <laughs> so, what uh, you guys know is that I, d I forgot, I actually missed. Um, is that when you level up this dragon, it gets more tentacles, as you can see by the top one, just flailing about there. It used to be just a single uh, tail there, so we're going to increase its speed. Then we're going to... We should increase its health. Let's... Okay. So, so far, is there... Is the tentacle getting a little bit longer? With every... I think that... I think it is getting slightly bigger. Are you ready? We're about to become a medium dragon. Or, or maybe, maybe one more. There you go. Oh, there it is! So it's, it's slowly getting bigger. So uh, it, it seems to be 25 for everything, so that's good. Okay, not seeing too much change. Still, we're about to unlock the new ability. Bam! Yeah, we got a third tentacle on the bottom. The ghost leviathan is getting stronger. Uh, so yeah, we're, we're getting there. Almost on a large dragon, and boom, there it is. Large dragon. So what was that extra ability we got? Chance of explosion on electric beam impact hitting multiple enemies. So now we're a large dragon. We can pretty much uh, take on the... I think we can eat the small ghosts now, like the blue ones. Um, but we're not going to stop there. No way. We're going to keep on going and boom. There you go. Um, didn't seem to get an extra tentacle with that one. But now electric beam rebounds to three additional enemies in range. And uh, if we want... Oh, uh, what should we upgrade a little bit? 10 and 10. Boom! There we go. XL. Level 30 Electrozoa. Or as you want to call it. I like the Ghost Leviathan. That sounds cool. So we're going to take this guy out for a spin. Uh, reach 121,000 points. Now, it was it's usually quite slow. Um, but I'm hoping it'll be a lot quicker now that we've upgraded it. It's basically an XL dragon, which is on par with the largest dragons out there. So, oh my god, it's huge. And when we boost, oh, <laughs> yes, like the whole flock of birds are dead. Oh my God, look at it go, ghosts vaporized. Bam. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Look at this. I mean, the gold rush isn't go, I mean, you could, we could just boost continuously. We're probably gonna hit a, like a fairy godmother. And there we go. The beam of electricity! Oh, this is it. This is how you get the highest gold, isn't it? Oh, and I forgot we could put pets on it as well. I'm an idiot. So we keep on boosting. Keep the times 12. By the time anything's on screen, it's already been lasered. Oh my god. This is awesome. Okay, okay, guys. Uh, we'll tell you what. We'll get the... Have we already done the mission? I think we might have already done that mission. So what I'll do... Yeah, we have. We'll exit this run and we'll put the pets on because I completely forgot about the pets. Oh, there it is. It's massive. <laughs> and some extra shards. So we didn't get an egg, but that's okay because I completely forgot. We can put four friggin' things on it. So... What should we... Should we increase the speed? I feel like with this guy, the speed is probably the best thing to do. I mean, we do have these special things like slows down enemies, flying horn attack. We got two of the Halloween uh, pets, which I never even covered in the video. So I do apologize for that. Uh, kills ghosts for rewards off with their heads. Um, I, th I think he just cuts their heads off, actually. But I'm, I want to kind of go with speed. Um, if we get the boost 10%, the boost is actually electric, so we'll go for speed there. Um, really, Christmas is around the corner, so hopefully we can get the Santa pet, which uh, would give us unlimited boost, making it one of the mo the best um, of all of um, the pets out there. Eating range 100%? Does that 
mean that the electric is increased by 100%. It's worth a shot. We'll give that a go. Um, I'm trying to think what else. Food 10%. Should we just get the boost an extra 10%? We'll get the boost an extra 10%. So we fly 20% faster. We have 10% extra electric and have an eating range of 100% extra. Um, so in theory, I mean, if it's all right, then we should be able to electrocute things at twice the range. Don't know if that's true. Also, things have a chance of exploding. So, bah! Oh my god, what would it be like if we got hungry? <gasps> we would be so big. Okay, so as you can tell, we are a lot quicker. Look at this. Oh, this is awesome. And the boost just keeps on going. Cha, cha, cha. Electrocute them all. I mean, wow. 100, 130 odd. I mean, we don't seem to get into... Um, oh, no! The, the bloody ghost. We don't seem to get into uh, gold rush as quick as we do. There it is. Oh, beautiful. Actually, we should just increase the um, the gold rush because look at this. I mean, it's it's cool. But I don't... I, is it better than this, this ability where you just literally electrocute everything within radius? Oh my god, is this how we get the highest score? I mean, obviously we'd need to put the pets on if we were going for the highest score. But it would appear this may be a way. And if you do it in bursts as well... Oh my god, you've got such a big eating range. I mean, do we really need the eating range? Because if the electric means that that's what happens and we just double the electric range, that Kraken is, is sorely helpful when it comes to this guy. So actually, we've been through here, so we've already electrocuted everything. Well, we may have missed a couple of things. There we go. There's a couple of things missed. And all we need to do is boost for a little bit. And we've got everything. Oh my god. Half a million points so far. It's already showing like tiny font for the score. So I'm wondering if that means that we could get a crazy... I mean, we haven't even maxed this guy up. He's, he's the biggest he can be, but he's not the strongest he can be. Or he, she. Oh, whatever. Ooh. Oh no. No! Friggin' piranhas, can I not electrocute into the water? I surely should be able to. Do we get more points from eating things than we do electrocuting them? Ah, that would be interesting. Okay, so let's go along this way. Oh, yes! Over a million points now. That's pretty good, I think. I don't know. Like, I can't remember what my highest score is. I don't think it's too crazy. Okay, there we go. Just electrocute all these. Oh, God! He looks so cool, though. You can def- I mean, I don't know if they really took inspiration from the Ghost Leviathan from Subnautica, but it's a really cool design either way. I don't want to also- uh, <laughs> ins offend- like, I don't want to offend anybody who came up with the design either, because it's a really cool design. It just kind of does look like the Ghost Leviathan. The head's different, okay, I know! <laughs> he's like, well, he's got a point. <laughs> <laughs> this love like somewhere in Boston and the guy's like, ah! <laughs> He's not a ghost of <laughs> Oh dear. Anyway, I love you. Let's keep going. 1.3 million. And showing no signs of dying. Because the electric beam actually means that we, um, we get the food from stuff. Oh, yep. And the big things as well. Hold on, hold on. Oh my god, that music. Oh, can we can we do can we do this a space soundscape again? Can I have an echo in my voice? Like yeah, 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 there we go. Wonders of the natural world. Whoever came up with this music? The hungry dragon. Genius. Love it. Oh my god. I do actually genuinely love it. <laughs> I love that soundscape sort of stuff. I like video game music to be honest. I'm none of this, um, I, well, it depends what the pop music is. Sometimes pop music uh, can be good, <laughs> per se, I suppose. Uh, but for the majority, I, I don't know. Ooh, it's a parrot. The dragon's chasing a parrot. That's new. Wasn't it a little Tweety Bird? I see. See, I saw the difference there. Used to be a different dragon. Seems to be a little bit slower when it comes to the water. The other dragon, I think, is also slower. The, the electric... Sorry, the... Um, the robotic dragon. Oh, look at him. He's so cool. There you go. So do I get more points from eating those? Like the ghosts? Is that what I should do? Should I just eat the ghosts and laser beam everything else? 
What about even in a cage? You fool! Metal conducts electricity! I thought there'd be some cool effect in the water as well, possibly. Oh no, no! Damn it, I ate some junk. Hold on, hold on, let's eat these guys. Uh, it didn't seem to increase anything, did it? Right, I think, do I have any missions? Like, regular missions? Uh, or, no, okay, so you can't just do the, the gold missions with this guy. Okay, so you've only got the shard missions. Because that would be quite interesting. So already we made, oh god, straight into the mine. I'm a ghost, though. I look like a ghost. I'm hollow. And it's, I, I love, look at that. Look at that animation. <laughs> Damn eagles. You see, if you touch me, you should be electrocuted. That's what should be happening. I'm going to go over here, just destroy all of this. Ooh. Going into the dark place would be quite cool. I wonder if I have a little light that emits from me. That would be interesting. Don't know why I'm going around this way. Oh, we should see what he looks like out. Yeah, there you go. I bet this, this would look awesome. Oh, hold on, stamina. Oh, look at it. I just love this swirl. It's so much fun. I love this game. Oh, my Jesus. What's, what's sent me flying there? Lord knows. Oh, damn it. I was hoping to get a gem there. Oh, health is going down pretty quick. Uh, I don't know if I like it. Oh, uh, uh, there you go. Kind of got in there. Back into the real world, please. So we're on two million. We're doing really well. Oh, finally. Is, oh, is that Gold Rush? No, it's not Gold Rush. It looked like it was Gold Rush for a second there. Okay, let's go down this way. We've already been here before, though. That's kind of a problem. But what I'm going to do is we're going to go around the, the poisony way. Because usually you can't go this way without eating some sort of junk. But because I've got my lightning ability, hopefully... Ooh, can I burn that? No, I can't burn that. Okay. Destroy all of this. Little boat. Little boy in a boat. Ooh, yes. Oh, all of the ghosties. Yeah, usually with a regular dragon, you eat the ghosts and you're on times 12, you instantly get into Gold Rush. But not with this one, though. I mean, you don't seem to get too many points for electrocute. Maybe, maybe if that was the case, they've already tested it and they were like, whoa, this is a bit too OP. <laughs> That would make sense. Okay, into the darkness. Into the realms. The other realm. I'm gonna go on here. Zap all of this. Oh, God, it's gone already. Okay. Right, so I don't zap the crystals. I still have to bash into the crystals. Okay. But because there's, like, so little things to attack in here, having the electric ability is really good. Um. Oh, God. Whoop. Because you, you tend to run out of your... Oh, God, did I just destroy the uh, the big mama? I think I might have already electrocuted the big mama there. Um, oh, I got the music again, man. It's awesome. Yeah, because... Oh, you actually tried to bite me there. <laughs> Little bugger. Yeah, you, you run out of your times bonus really quick. As you can see there, it, it just vanished instantly. And I guess any sort of creature that has a chance to attack you is automatically um, vaporized into oblivion. So, yeah, this is w way easier. Although it does, like, it does run out pretty quick. Ooh. Yes, time's it. Let's see how long we can keep this. Oh, God. Oh, I zap the icicles. Oh, sorry, the stalactites. Awesome. Okay, is that a dead end? Yeah, it's a dead end. I don't destroy the uh, egg sac things, though. Hmm. Uh, don't know about this. Hmm. Still not my favorite place. I don't really like this one. Just because I feel like I, when I go here, I just lose my times bonus and there's nothing too crazy to eat. Yeah, there's these jellyfish things on there. There we go. So I still need to find a way to utilize it, whether it's like if I'm in a gold rush or I'm close to a mega rush, do I go down here? It's probably going to be the way I'm going to go here. Where's this secret place? There is a secret place. I think I'm going I'm going down to the water again, aren't I? Ooh, yes, I am. Yep. Need to go back up before I die. Oh, uh, looks like it's gonna happen. Oh my god, the health. The health, the health. Ah! <laughs> Three, almost four million, though. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'm just wondering. I feel like there's not too much difference um, from having this dragon small and then having it maxed out. It gets like a couple of tentacles, it gets a lot bigger, and its zap gets increased. But you don't necessarily... Oh my god, look at all that. Look at all the perks. Um, but you don't necessarily see... 
um, all of the explosions and but you do notice that the electric zaps like a whole bunch of birds and to be honest we're only halfway we could increase this guy for twice the speed twice the health and twice the stamina so yeah i can only imagine how powerful this thing can get but at the same time i do want to max this thing up because i would love to see drops bombs in addition to a machine gun attack and Unleashes a mini gun, a mi a mini gun, <laughs> a mini gun drone, which fires upon enemies. Like that would look amazing as well. Um, but now that I've got this guy maxed out, I mean, four. Mi I don't even know what my highest score is. <laughs> Maybe it is five million, six million. So we're pretty close there, and that's only half of the potential. If we go back to the regular dragons, XL, um, like this dragon's really, really good, um, but it does not have the amount of perks that the, um, the special dragons can have on them in the Witch's Bruise segment. Um, so I think in the next video, what we'll do is we'll go back here and we'll max this thing out um, and give that a spin and just see how good that is. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.